Hello, welcome, Cabbage here. So, now we are getting to the, kind of the main event of the Tower of Champions, uh, which are floors 21 and up. Uh, here, the um, difficulty goes way up. Uh, could be even considered uh, impossible difficulty. And then, uh, yeah, I played the uh, first couple stages and I thought that they were difficult enough um, that I didn't want to shoot them uh, quote-unquote live. Uh, and then I wanted to, uh, yeah, get a clear and then uh, talk over that like I usually do. And also, um, my uh, video camera that I use also happens to be my uh, sub-device. I wanted to use uh, the characters in my sub-device as well. Um, so yeah, that's another reason why. Alrighty, so floor 21. Uh, we want to use uh, water characters with a uh, null damage wall. Um, and then we also want to use characters with uh, recovery um, because, uh, yeah, everybody does a lot of damage in this mission. Uh, like this Meteo, for example. Um, but that means, actually, that there are only two characters, uh, two Hatcher characters that we can use um, that have both uh, Null Damage Wall and Recovery. And uh, they are Sakura and then Anubis, uh, both the Ascension form. Um, yeah, and then the other two guys, uh, you can use anyone, um, as long as they're not a Demi-Hume. Alrighty. And so the boss is uh, Wyatt Earp here. And then uh, you want to use characters that can uh, take away a lot of uh, damage as well. Um, this is another mission where it's sort of uh, kill or be killed, um, because, uh, yeah, again, the enemies do a lot of damage. Uh, so we're using Kenshin. Uh, she has the Pierce and the uh, Fire Slayer, so she can do a lot of damage um, directly. And then I'm also using uh, Yamato Takeru. I don't usually like to use him because uh, he has that uh, damage wall on the gauge, um, but his uh, lock-on one-way laser um, does a lot of damage, so it's kind of uh, needed to get through this uh, mission quickly. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, Wyatt Earp's uh, X-Laser, that's kind of the one thing that we can avoid. Um, so if we can stay on uh, Wyatt Earp's, um, you know, on the vertical or in the horizontal, then we can avoid that uh, bit of damage. Alright, I gotta say, I am enjoying this uh, Tower of Champions. It's different. And then, uh, you know, you're not obligated, well, you're never obligated to use Max Lux, but I'm not tempted to use Max Lux. I guess that's the uh, correct wording. And then, uh, yeah, I get to use characters that I uh, usually wouldn't. Uh, like for Anubis, uh, for example, I usually like to use the uh, evolution form, uh, because the, um, the strike shot does a lot more damage. Uh, but yeah, this gave me an excuse to uh, bust out my uh, Ascension Anubis, so that was pretty cool. Okay, we'll hit all our guys to get that recovery. Oh, and it seems like uh, in this stage, uh, hearts never appear. Um, yeah, I see a lot of boots and uh, swords, so that's uh, is probably another reason why uh, they recommend uh, the healing. Alright, here is the boss stage. So yeah, we can see that Wyatt Earp has a lot of attacks coming very quickly. Yeah, and kind of the main one is this one here, the, um, the Meteor. Uh, can't avoid that, and then, yeah, it takes away a lot, so we just have to deal with it. And then, um, every other turn, uh, Wyatt Earp does a defense up on herself. And then, uh, when she does that, it's not, uh, worth attacking her at all. Um, so you want to focus on the, uh, the little guys, uh, while she's under the, uh, defense up mode. Uh, which lasts for two turns. Alright, so it's off again, so we can go after um, the, 
the boss directly again. Yep, there's the X-Laser, there's the healing. What are we gonna do? Alright, we're gonna use the Strike Shot to see if we can get our speed up high enough to go through the gravity barrier and then hit everybody for the recovery. And it looks like we did, so good. Yikes. Alright, we're gonna try to take out the boss here. And we got it. HP's not looking great. <laughs> uh, that's another thing about uh, Yamato Takeru, is that uh, his hit points are pretty low, so... Alright, so we'll use Anubis' Strike Shot. Yeah, still really strong. Um, the evolution would have done over 2 million though. And yes, I guess we'll use uh, Yamato Takeru's here as well. Yeah, I uh, forgot that uh, Wyatt Earp got the, um, the defense up, so it didn't do uh, any damage at all to the boss. Uh, but we did take out one of the little guys, so... Silver lining. Okay. And uh, Wyatt Earp, uh, the character, um, she's decent at the moment, uh, but she will get a buff later, uh, which will make her good for uh, Kushinada. Alright, here's a good chance to heal. And take down the boss. Alright, excellent. Okay, last gauge. Uh, we'll see if we can use uh, whatever strike shots we have. Yeah, there are uh, lots of uh, playthrough videos on uh, YouTube uh, in Japanese about the Tower of Champions. And then uh, some of them are even, um, they feature like all drop monsters um, playing through these uh, floors. Uh, I will not be doing that. <laughs> uh, so yeah, all of these videos that I'll be doing from floors 21 to 30, um, they will be uh, first clear videos. Um, because I'm going to play them once, and probably only once, um, just to uh, clear through the, the tower this time. And um, also, for that reason, uh, my knowledge for the floors won't be that great, um, because uh, at the time that I make the videos, um, I'll only have cleared them once, so... Ooh, there's a meteor again. Alright, we'll see if we can hit everybody for the recovery... no. Alright, we're in a bit of a pinch. Thankfully, we mostly missed that uh, X-Laser. Alright, we'll buy ourselves some time with uh, Kenshin's Strike Shot. Ooh! And we'll take her out anyway, so great. Okay, so that's floor 21. That took me maybe, I think it was two or three times to clear, so... Yeah, so again, uh, bring uh, null damage wall characters that can do uh, lots of damage uh, quickly. And then if you have them, bring a Sakura or Anubis uh, for the recovery. Alrighty, so we'll see you again. Take care.